Am I ready? Am I ready? Am I ready? That's what you said it. Am I ready? Am I ready? That's what you said it. That's what you said it. But I need me some ready. Don't want your heady. Don't want your heady. Am I ready? I'm rocking steady. I'm rocking steady. I'm rocking steady. Back to go fetty, don't need your heady. Need me some bready, but you know I'm kinda letty. Know I'm kinda letty, and I'm coming real fetty. Coming real fetty, may need me some letty. Am I ready? Am I ready? Simply letty. Simply letty. And I sleep alone with Teddy, don't need no heady. Don't need no heady. Sleep alone with Teddy, but I need me some bready. Am I ready? I'm rocking steady. Your word is very daddy. You can't even see. And your new beginning is a bumblebee. Are you ready? Are you ready? I'm rocking steady. Are you ready? I'm rocking steady. Don't need no Freddy, don't need no Freddy. I'll take some heady. I'll take some heady. But not without no Breddy. Not without no Breddy. Yeah, I'm rocking steady, and I'm about to go Freddy. Steady, stand steady. steady. Steady, stand steady, and I stay up on my P's cause you know that I'm praying and you know I'm a quick. I stay up on my P's, my P's and Q's. You know that I'm praying and you know that I'm a queen. Do you know what I mean? But I'm really on the scene, really on the scene, and God hold my dream. God hold my dream. Do you know what I mean? But I'm really on the scene cause I got my self esteem. Do you know what I mean? Know what I mean? And I stay up on the YouTube motherfucking scene. Do you know what I mean? Still in my dream, y'all been still in my dream. Do you know what I mean? But I'm coming real steady, coming real steady. And you said, Am I ready? And you said, Am I ready? I'm about to go fatty. And I'm peaches with my peaches with my dreams, and I'm in my missing jeans, and I'm really on the scene. What? Am I ready? Okay, I it cut off. Um, too quick or whatever. So I'm going to have to practice on that. Practice on that, y'all. You know, just a little bit to catch up with my words because I got even more words that go with that song. I didn't sing it how I wrote it. You know, it seems better when I just do it on my own, like just with the words and the music or whatever. But um, I'm going to have to work on that. I've been working on it, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, um, am I ready? That's what God is telling us. That's what your divine masculine is saying. But that's what you're saying. You're like, um, nah, I don't too much think I'm ready anymore. We already been through this and I'm so over it right now. I got some more to go with that and I will play it eventually. Soon. Celebrate is stalking and stealing from you. Don't trust them. So this is a whole celebrity out here doing this. Uh, like I say, I told y'all to go ahead and if any of my words or whatever that y'all see, period, on YouTube, that people you hear it in their songs or whatever, whatever, just know they was mine. If you haven't ever heard them in any of the rappers or whatever, because we all got our own thing, our own style. And, you know, I know, um, what's his name or whatever? I can't remember. Uh, but he, uh, kind of like, he's the one that made YouTube. I mean, really, uh, he was born on the internet. He, um, what is his name? I just was listening to him. I'm going to have to come back and tell y'all his name. Someone has a crush on you. It's a Scorpio. So, a Scorpio have a crush on you, but celebrities is stealing your stuff so you know these people have to go into everywhere to get their stuff to make their music or whatever and it's better to have copywritten like all of that or whatever they go with whole 
you know, songs that I'm making, I've started learning. It's been big time celebrities that people don't really look into that have stolen from people in the past that, and they got a lawsuit on them. So you got to be careful. I know that they're taking stuff from me, every word, everything I speak. I turn around and it, I hear it in somebody's music, whatever, whatever. Never heard it before, but it's mine. And like YouTubers and you people that really, you know, not looking into that, don't know people's situation. Y'all don't know that they took it from someone else. They're lying and they slept with her. So someone slept with someone or whatever. Um, stay awake at night uh, thinking about you. Please accept me back. Someone is thinking about you and they're staying awake at night. But they did sleep with someone. Probably, I'm assuming, someone you know. You know they slept with someone. Tired of being non-committal. Can we be together? So whoever this person is, they're tired. They're tired. They're tired, baby. They're tired. They're tired. Okay? So anyways, or whatever, like I say, it's mine. You know, I'm working on more like getting my lawyer or whatever, you know. Um, because that's what I was doing with the jobs or whatever, like when, you know, we, uh, went into as a group or whatever, and, uh, just the person, the, um, like, I think it was the third person that got done wrong. Like I had been done or whatever. They went to legal aid pursuit. I had, which I had already went or whatever, whatever, but like, you know, I'm just saving up little bits and pieces of money. So, I wish that you guys would donate. Donate to my channel. Dollar Signs Charlie's Angel 75. I need all donations because I need all of my stuff copywritten. $99. You know, I have gotten what I could get copywritten. I haven't put it out on, you know, I haven't put the copywritten uh, desk, uh, declar, declar, declaration. What do you, how do you call it? I'm going to have to bet. It's, I can't say it, but I haven't put it out there for some of my poetry. Some of my poetry is copywritten. Just if they take it, they're going to like, they're going to get a judgment call. Someone has a crush on you. Someone is gossiping. They're quite young. They're looking to backstab you in your back page of swords. This could be an air sign. They're gossiping about you, but they're a celebrity and they're stealing your stuff and they're an air sign or whatever, but they're going to have a big judgment call from the past and everything like stuff is going to start coming up about them. That's going to put them in a rant that's going to, you know, and it's going to be their payback from taking from you, trying to compete with you. They're stalking you. They're quite young. They're younger than you are, but they're, they're gossiping about you um, because, you know, they just hate the fact you are who you are and they need to just stay in their own lane. You know, if they were supportive or liking me of you and not seek, sneaking around and doing it, then it would be cool or whatever. If they were linking up with you or whatever, paying you for your shit, not trying to like flip switch and take words and go against you or like they're in a fight with you or a competition then yeah, it would because a competitive person is a jealous hearted person, which is a person that's, you know, not, do not know their, their self-worth. If you copy anybody, you don't know your self-worth. If you take from any, you don't know your self-worth. If you try to one-up people, you don't know your self-worth. You're insecure or whatever. It's best that everyone just stay in their own lane and do their own thing. Okay. But they can't do that. So eventually God is going to end You'll see it and I'll, I'll be suing somebody from out of, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, it, it's nothing. I've called several lawyers and, you know, they telling me or whatever, like, if this is going on truthfully, like, they ready to jump on the case already, whatever, without, you know, with a little bit of nothing down payment. So it is what it is. And I got a lawyer myself here, Everett Seymour, who, which have fought, for me, since I was a young teen and got away, you know, things happen, okay? He's not no one to play with. And he deal with rappers and all of that, too, like from in Texas or whatever. And he deal with drug charges, rapper, whatever, whatever. He's done a lot of stuff. He even have went to people's house to, like, he go to his client's house, have stayed nights and all of that. That's how good he is. Six of Swords uh, resolution. So... 
someone has a crush on you and they're coming up with a resolution on how to communicate with you or whatever because they don't know which way to come at you because now you're on your P's and Q's. You've been praying and you're a queen and you got your self-esteem. Pray in P's and Q's. Prayers and you're a queen. P, praying, Q, queen. If you hear my shit on anybody's music, it's mine, okay? And come in and the come, come, come let me know if you hear it or whatever because, yeah, I'm going to sue somebody. I am. I'm so sick of this. Like, do your own thing and get your own stuff. So they're lying. They slept with her. Ace of Wands, this is a fire sign and they could see you as an inspiration. But, you know, maybe before in the past, this person was trying to get back at you or whatever. Or, you know, do something ugly towards you because, you know, you guys couldn't see eye to eye. But, you know, um, it still is what it is. They see you as an inspiration or whatever because they, they're lying. They slept with someone behind your back and now, you know, all to you know, feel empty again because they thought they were doing something ugly to reject you or make you feel less than or one up you or something. But you have always been the inspiration. And if they come back lying, trying to say they didn't sleep with this person, they did. They're a liar. But you're the inspiration of it all. Like, you know, you, you, you're tell, taking it like a grain of salt or whatever, like, oh, well, you know, stay awake at night. This person is up at night awaken from what they have done page of wands ideas uh stay awake at night thinking about you uh, please accept me back there uh this person uh, could have been acting immature they was taking your ideas or whatever they are quite young quite immature they're stalking you passionately and they want your ideas passionately whoever this person is is what I'm getting. It could be a king of cups a commitment. Now they want a commitment because tired of being non-committal. Can we be together? They want a commitment because this person, they want to be in the leadership position now and want to take a leap of faith to come towards you now after they didn't did all this shit and up at night or whatever. You had brought good ideas to the table. You were an inspiration to this person, whoever this person was. This person is could be a water sign, could have fire in their chart or whatever, but they were immature. They were taking your ideas. They had no idea that you were the person that you you were you had to be the leader in this situation the king of wands passionately and you stood in your truth and you took the leap of faith and food fool this motherfucker right up out of his face or whatever because of your ideas this person was taking your abundance spiritually physically emotionally mentally or whatever and they were a non-committal person but now they want to come back but they're holding on to something to do with their past they want to come back or whatever and they're staying up at night on how they could charge in and be of 